Finding Sagira brings up a lot of old memories. When you picked up her shell, you were able to access something left behind. A psychic fingerprint. I believe the relic awoke a new ability within you. One that reveals what lies beneath the surface. One rooted in darkness. Something tells me this witness Sabathun mention is directly tied to her theft of the light. We need to hear more of that fingerprint. Which means you need to strengthen that ability. We've learned from the Pyramid on Europa before. Head there. Eris will guide you. If my instincts are correct, this ability could be just what we need to solve this case. Guardians have harnessed its power before. There is more for the taking. How will communing with darkness help us understand the voices we heard when we found Sagira's shell? Reach the statue at the heart of the pyramid. Strengthen your connection to the darkness, and they will see beyond the limitations of normal sight. I'm picking up a Cabal transmission. I pulled a clip for you. To the warriors of the Cabal Empire, defectors march upon the European Pyramid, searching for trinkets of darkness. Their expedition is not sanctioned. Any that join them act alone. My father's obsession with the voice in the darkness must not infect our own ranks. I guess this means the Empress won't mind us fighting our way in.
Cabal's shield blocking the doorway. Looks like they got up here first. is reacting to our presence somehow. Opening doors, moving platforms. Perhaps it senses something in you. When I explored these strange passageways, I felt it sensed something in me, too. I resented it at first. To believe it recognized in me some secret kinship. But like you, Guardian, I have learned to use it. everywhere. It looks like they're trying to establish a foothold inside the pyramid. Hoping to pilfer artifacts of darkness for their war against war itself, I assume. Zivu Arath destroyed their homeworld, and the conquerors do not take well to being conquered. I think that device is jamming the pyramid's movement somehow. said the pyramid recognizes something in us, Eris. But what? A defender. A finely honed blade. A curiosity. It could be any of those. Or none. My Cora too has asked this question, and my answer is always the same. Pure speculation. I worry the ambiguity weighs on her too heavily.
I don't think the pyramid is helping us out of generosity, Guardian. It's manipulating us, using us somehow. The darkness is a neutral force, but the pyramids have an agenda. Until we know what it is, we can't let our guard down. Something must control these ships. We've never seen a pilot. In her journeys beyond the Heliopause, Queen Marisov encountered the entity that commands the pyramids. She said its mind spoke louder than any other she has ever heard. A cacophony of thought. Perhaps those voices steer these ships. Horus said that this new ability allows you to see psychic imprints of past events. And if you commune with the pyramid, you might be able to see the imprint on Sagira's shell. It's strange. The light made you forget, and now the darkness helps you remember. The 
Cabal are trying to destroy the statue. We have to stop them, or you won't be able to commune with the pyramids. Terrace, we communed with the statue. We can't tell yet if anything has changed. It seems like we might not notice the effects until we're back in Sabathun's throne world. 
Either way, we don't want to stay here longer than we have to. Wise. These ships are still a mystery to us. 